So these are the top nine Unreal Engine 5 games that are coming up in the year 2023. And all the games that are picked so far are one of the most anticipated games of all times. Now let's start off with the first one, which is The Day Before, which is an open world zombie survival role playing game, which is completely multiplayer. And the game is being developed by Fantastic Studios. And they've now recently announced that the game is going to be released on 1st March 2023 on the PlayStation. 5 xbox series x as well as on the pc version now the game is not going to be available on the last gen consoles meaning the ps4 and now moving on to the next one which is arc 2 now if you have been playing video games for a while then you would probably know that arc survival has been one of the most highest critically acclaimed dinosaur survival game that has ever been created so far and arc 2 is now officially finally announced as of now the developers of arc 2 have not yet given us any specific release date but then and all they've said is that the game is going to be released in the year 2023 so we only have the release window but not an exact release date as of now and another very interesting thing is that Win Diesel is now going to be casted as the main protagonist of Arc 2 now obviously the Hollywood fans are going to be very interested in this game and now that we have to play with dinosaurs I think it's going to be a mixed action of all the RPG and dinosaur survival games and up next is Banisher the Ghost of New Eden. Now this is a game that is heavily inspired from the PlayStation exclusive God of War and now it's also available on PC so, so I don't think it's considerably known as a PlayStation exclusive anymore. But Banisher Ghost of a New Eden brings out a whole new aspect of recreating what God of War basically stands for. The visuals are fantastic when it comes to fantasy games that are kind of set in a semi open world. I think from all of the lists this is by far one of the games that I am very very excited for in 2023 now, now unfortunately if you don't own a playstation 5 then you will not be able to play this game because sony has made this game a playstation 5 exclusive which means that it's not going to be available on pc neither on xbox series x and it's also exclusive only for the next gen console so it's only available on the playstation 5 now obviously we know sony after a couple months or maybe a year or so they're most likely going to be releasing this game also on the pc version and up next is is Alan Wake 2 which is developed and published by Remedy Entertainment and is basically a single player horror game a sequel to the already existing Alan Wake game which is really popular back in those days and it's once again back and this time around the game is being developed with the next gen technology of Unreal Engine 5 and of course the game is only going to be releasing on the PlayStation 5 Xbox Series X as well as on the PC version now for those of the old school fans who love the first Alan Wake game and don't own the next gen consoles i think it is now the perfect time to go ahead and upgrade your systems to the next gen consoles and up next we have atlas fallen it is a semi open world fantasy game which is coming up in the year 2023 now the game of course introduces a destiny like style but we have a bunch of very unique monsters that you can fight off and it's basically a fantasy game with different magics and superpowers and all this stuff and of course atlas fallen is a next gen exclusive meaning that it's only going to be released on the playstation 5 xbox series x and the pc version and the game is currently being developed on the all new unreal engine 5.1 which means we have better shadows better ray tracing and a bunch of technical stuff which is going to make the game look so much better and truly next gen now atlas fallen is currently set to be released somewhere in 2023 but we don't really have an exact release date for this game as well but since this year they've already announced that e3 is going to be taking place with all of these games which don't have really release date most likely getting a new gameplay along with an official release date now moving on to the next one we have what is known as one of the most anticipated game of 2023 which is something that i don't think the gaming community needs any explanation about what this game is or how it is going to be because we already know that final fantasy is always said to be a masterpiece and rebirth is going to be an exclusive for playstation 5 only and, and the game is set to be released somewhere during the late 2023 and there's also a few speculations which basically states that the game could get delayed all the way to 2024. And up next we have a Payday 3 which is a first person shooter multiplayer game where you basically commit a lot of different heists. There are cops and thieves and all that stuff. And if you've ever played video games on the PC, I'm pretty sure that you guys might have come across Payday 1 or Payday 2 at any point of your life. And Payday 3 is now being developed on Unreal Engine 5.1 which means that the graphics and fidelity and ray tracing everything is going to be on 
to the point now however for those of you guys who own the last gen consoles this is a great news because payday 3 is coming for both the last gen as well as the next gen consoles meaning you can play it on the playstation 4 xbox one as well as xbox series x and ps5 the game is going to be launching in the year 2023 now moving on to the next one which is critically acclaimed as one of the best horror survival games which is the stalker 2. now it is a first person shooter survival game which is set in the vast open world of chernobyl now this game is basically all about the virus being spread all across the place in a post-apocalyptic world and the graphics and gameplay and everything that they have shown off seems to just make your eyes bleed in terms of visual fidelity because this game seems to be representing what an unreal engine 5 could do to a first person shooter now of course stalker 2 is one of my most anticipated game of 2023 and unfortunately the game is only going to be exclusive to xbox series x and xbox series s as well as for the pc players now for those of you guys who own the playstation 5 console it is not going to be available on sony's platform so it's exclusive that microsoft owns and even if you don't own an xbox if you have a pc then you will still be able to play this game so the game is initially set to be releasing summer in 2023 but of course we don't have an official release date yet but i think we are going to be getting a full-on gameplay reveal as well as a new official release date for this game during the e3 which is going to be taking place in june of 2023 and moving on to the final game which is by far one of my most favorite it's my all-time favorite in the entire list a whole new level of expectations for all the upcoming future games and it's being developed by chinese developers now the game i'm talking about is none other than black myth wukong where you basically play as a monkey king and in a semi-open world game set in ancient chinese mythology and of course when it comes to graphics fidelity and the gameplay mechanisms and there is so much in this game that i can just keep on going for and by far from all the games that we have spoken so far i think that black myth wukong is the only game after the day before which is going to be setting apart the entire expectations of what unreal engine 5 is capable of achieving now the good part about this game is that it is also going to be releasing on the last gen consoles as well as on the next gen consoles although the game truly looks like a next gen and also plays like a next gen the developers of black myth wukong have made sure that every single one of you guys who own the playstation 4 or the playstation 5 should be able to play their game so it is going to be releasing on both the current gen consoles and the next gen consoles as well as on the pc version now the developers of this game have not given us any specific release date yet unfortunately but they've been giving us a lot of in-game action through some of the gameplays that they've been revealing back to back every single time we have any kind of event black myth wukong has always been this one game that the entire gaming community are really excited to get their hands on so the game is set to be released somewhere around 2023 on the next gen and current gen consoles so let me know down below in the comments which one of these entire list of unreal engine 5 games are you guys excited and if you guys think that i missed any of the most anticipated games and games Games that actually look like truly next gen and is worthy being on this list then please make sure to go ahead leave your feedbacks down in the comments so i hope you guys did go on and enjoy this video if you guys did please go ahead smash a big fat like and please let me know down below in the comments which one of these games are you guys most excited for and like you guys already know i always keep you guys updated with all the latest information that you guys need about all the upcoming open world games and informations leaks and basically everything that is related to open world games is going to be available right here on my channel so make sure to go ahead subscribe to my channel and turn the notifications on and set the notification settings to all because if you don't do that the broadcast youtube platform you guys know it better they just don't send you guys the notifications of my daily video so make sure you guys do it and with that being said i wish you all a merry christmas and i hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your day and i'll see you guys on tomorrow's video until then take it easy fams and goodbye